Right, so I've come back to it, found some more voltages to poke at. So currently, um, I'm looking on the XY PCB, which is uh, that one there. On it is a connector, and it's got 150, ground, 12, 5, minus 12, nicely labelled. So I think this is a good place to uh, poke around and look at some voltages. So currently we're looking at the 150 volt line. If I turn it on, I've got my meter hooked up. Well, my meter says 146.3 volts, so that's working. Okay, let's knock it off. Let's look at the 12 volts. Okay. And let's power that on. 11.96, that'll do. Um, 5 volts. 4.81, that'll do. And minus 12 volts. Minus 11.96. So, they're all good. So I've noticed on the schematic there is a 130 volt line uh, coming into the scope as well. So I'm trying to hunt that down at the moment. Um, I've managed to hunt down the 150 volt line that comes on to here through to VR705 which is that pot there. And I've managed to tag on to the wiper and beep it all the way through to this point here. So that's connected. Now I'm just trying to hunt this 130 volt line. Well it comes off the 150 volt. Goes through these three 121 ohm resistors. And out. Into here through another 39.2 2 kilo ohm resistor and then to ground to a 51k so um, it's a big potential divider so essentially I think they're taking 150 volts and then just popping it through a potential divider and then sending it through here but we'll see we'll see if that voltage is there but first I'm gonna beep between there and the back of the CRT board excuse me between there and the back of the CRT board to see if there's any continuity. So yeah, I did some more um, maths. So I've got V130 there, and then worked out V130 has about 49 volts. So, hmm, I think I better check that too. So yeah, um, hooked it up, and I'm getting. 131, not 149. So that point there is actually, because I'm measuring between there and uh, between these two resistors here and ground, that is actually 130 volts. Also, to um, fire work on the forums, mine is a lot different to yours, Chief. For example, on the power supply, I've got IC704. Is on here TDA 200 making my 12 volts. Okay, so the only two other things that I'm check tested on this tube are these connections here D1, D3, D4, and D2. They come from the XY board. Okay, so they go off. I found D4 and D3 anyway and on each one it says CA plus 75 volts so I don't know if that means that it's 75 volts DC roughly on there and there but it will be a good thing to check and going back through this amplifier find here MP1 and MP2 and it says here MP1 equals plus 6.5 volts, MP2 equals plus 1.5 volts da -da -da, to minus 1.1 volts. So I'm assuming if it's within that range, or it should be either at either of those ranges, 
I'm not quite sure, but anyway, more things to check. So just checking on this, and uh, D4 and D3 are possibly these two wires here. Uh, I've deduced this because on the schematic, these two come off straight off the board and then into the back of the CRT board. Whereas down here, D1 and D2, between them they have a 475 ohm resistor. Now the only two of the two lines that have resistors on them are those two, so I, those two are probably D4, a uh, D1 and D2. And there's D3 and D4. So if I stick a my meter on there, I should and turn it on. I possibly see 75 volts. Right, so I've tapped onto 0 volts on the uh, board, uh, the XY PCB, and going on the back of here. So there's 62.5 volts on there, and on the other side there's 88.4 volts.